Top five. Oh, I do not have enough energy for that. Top five worst Nancy game modes. You better subscribe. All right, at number five, we got Ice Warrior. My name might be Turtle, but I'm a big fan of moving around, and this game mode is just determined to not let that happen. Getting frozen basically means you're dead, you can't move, and you take three times more damage. Good thing it's hard to freeze people. Oh wait, flamethrowers take zero aim or skill, and not even fun to use. But when you're not frozen, the game mode's actually pretty fun. At number four is Boom Time. You didn't like howitzers? Well, here's its annoying little brother. With, like, rifles and shotguns, you actually have to shoot the enemies. But with bazookas, you just gotta shoot the ground. So as long as you're standing on anything besides a big chunk of ground, you're pretty much invincible. Like, this guy, Roof Camper, dives by a shotgun. Bazookas can't touch him. The big difference between a howitzer and a bazooka, though, is that the bazooka stun locks you. So if you got five rockets in there, all you have to do is shoot the ground five times near someone's feet, and they can't move, they can't fight back, they're just a goner. It doesn't really matter that the bazooka makes you move slow because you don't really need the move when you're stun locking the enemy with every shot. You just feel like a foosball getting knocked around by rockets all the time. And number three is Brawl. Look how much fun I'm having. Holding down the melee button. Thoroughly entertained. Fucking kill me. If you haven't noticed yet, I don't like melee and I fucking hate warriors. I quit because of drones and howitzers. Warriors are so much worse. You see, this guy's running away because he doesn't want to PvP. He knows it's not going to be fun because we're just going to slap each other like grown men. Then when you hit people, you have a chance for them just to fall over. And if you've been listening, you know I'm going to bitch about that. And now he knocks me over like it's a slapping contest. Did I mention that the games end instantly? Look at this game. Two minutes and 13 seconds and it's over. I recorded two rounds of gameplay for each Nancy game mode except for Brawl, which I recorded seven. The only reason it's not higher on the list is because running around with a high movement speed is actually kind of fun. As long as it's not also captured a flag, it should be... Eh, probably still shit. Warriors are ass. Coming in at number... At number... Number two. All right, last one, last one. All right, we all knew this was going to be on the list. Coming in at number two is Jet Fight. Yeah, look at this guy with the flag. Guess he's going to bitch about games ending too fast again. I don't think anyone likes the jetpacks. They up the skill cap. So now everyone sucks, not just me. But you know who doesn't suck? Drones. Now that everyone's ass because they can't aim with the jumping, the drones, they don't have to worry about that. They just have aimbot. Which then makes drones a bigger nuisance in this game mode? Now I've just realized I've been chasing the same guy with the flag across the entire map. And shocker, he scores! Oh, and did I mention there's still fall damage in the game mode that gives you a jetpack? Oh, and look, the same guy captured another flag. The regular life after jumping is the best in any game I've played. But the jetpacks, while it's a cool idea, is a bad take on changing the jumping. I think the better you are at PvP, the more you're gonna like this game mode, but most people just suck, so we all kinda hate it, me included. Finally at number one, we got Nancy Contests. Yeah, they had potential and they fucking blew it. 30k paywall to host a match? Meh, but what if no one shows up, which they usually don't? Well then, you just wasted 30k, and the five people that did show up, they wasted time. The biggest problem with contests is that no one shows up. You gotta pick one time the schedule ahead, usually by like a day. Oh, everyone just forgets that, or they're busy, because one time doesn't work for everyone, and you just get a dead Nancy contest. And what if the person hosting it is like, what if we put shitty settings so everyone hates it? And then they leave. 30k, gone. The ranking system also sucks, with the first priority being wins, and then the second being KD, which then gets people who are supposed to be playing for fun to play more seriously so they can rank. Honestly, it might be better if there just weren't rewards for ranking. And it's not round robin either, so you don't actually play all four teams. There was potential for Nancy contest, but nope, this is shit. Those are my top five worst Nancy game modes. If you want to see the top five best Nancy game modes, click over here on the right. Or if you want to subscribe, which you do, click over here on the left.